Hey guys, Ginger Beard here from Top Floor Basement Gaming. Uh, today we're going to do something a bit different. Uh, it's going to be my first Let's Play series uh, instead of just the short CSGO videos. Um, this is a game I really enjoy. Uh, it's Don't Starve Shipwrecked, which is a new early access edition for Don't Starve. <clears throat> um, and it's honestly awesome, at least to me. Really enjoy it. You like survival games and crafting and all that. There's tons of that to do in this game. Uh, I won't go on. Let's just get into it. Uh, this is a new character I just unlocked. She's meant for uh, this expansion, so we're going to give her another go. I usually just go with Wilson. Uh, her name's Wilani. Wilani. Not sure. One of the two. Could be a different mix out there, but anyway. Uh, let's get started. Alright, so we have crash landed on this island and let's survive. We're just gonna pick up everything we possibly can. We're gonna need it all, especially the flint at the beginning. But everything. Seashells are awesome. Uh, they're good for um, armor to protect you from um, obviously enemies and monsters and stuff but it's one of the first things you want to build because the snakes in this game are relentless uh, and if you get poisoned by one of the yellow ones uh, at the beginning of the game or like when you don't really have a camp set up you don't have a lot of materials you're gonna die it's pretty much uh, damage over time that you can't get rid of unless you make an anti-venom kit. They're not the easiest things to make. Oh. I bet you I can dig him up. Never tried it, but I bet you if I had a shovel you can dig them up. Alright, we got enough to make an axe. Actually, let's make pickaxe first just so we get more uh, flint to make more tools. I'm going to kind of explain things as I go, uh, just for people that haven't played it before and are interested. <laughs> we really, you know, one of the first things we should do too is try and find flowers and build a uh, garland. Really helps with your uh, sanity, because at night that's going to dip down. So. You wear one of those garlands. It'll uh, it'll keep you good for a while, and uh, you'll see what the if we if our sanity goes low, you'll see what that does in the later videos. A little bit sick right now. Sucks. Every winter I get sick three times at least it's horrible I'm always good all year until the winter don't know why I'm like that but anyway alright I think we picked up quite a bit of stuff chopped down this coconut tree uh, when we do set up a camp like usually the the island at least I find that you start off on really isn't that big or anything like or I just have gotten unlucky I've never set up a camp on the first island that we crash land on, so we'll see though. We might get lucky here, and it might have lots of biomes, etc. etc. Jeez. Uh, oh, and I forgot to mention uh, where we crash landed, which I'm thinking up there. There's a crate there. Uh, There'll be the, those boat items, uh, the the crates and the boat sail or whatever. You can break all those down with a hammer. So once you get a hammer, go back and break all that down. And, uh, you can get some lumber. I think you get a boat repair kit, which is is good to have early game for sure. We might actually even be able to build a hammer right now. So maybe we should go do that. Get some flint, like I said. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention... Uh, these limpet rocks are awesome. You can pick them, get those, the fungus or whatever's on them. and It's actually a food source. So don't, I, I don't break those down. I know you do get tons of materials from them, but it's not worth it. 
you, know, you, you can use them as you know constant food source. I'm not sure sure if it's all through all the seasons, but I don't even know all the seasons in this version. It's a bit different. I know I think next season's hurricane season, which gets crazy, tons of rain. Oh, it's just hell. Um, usually, I would start and chop some bamboo and these viney bushes down uh, to build a boat. You can build. Oh, cool. I didn't know, so you can rebuild the surfboard, and it's actually pretty cheap. I don't know how good it is. Um, the, the other. Characters I played her. I, I really just went around the island. I started on Tried her out. I think I put her boat in the water once. I think it's a bit better than the starter boats I'm not sure how well it is. I don't know if you can put a sail on it blah 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 blah, blah. but yeah. anyway <clears throat> You can't get enough stuff. That's why I'm going around like this no, it might seem kind of boring, but before you set up your little camp, we just need so much. And that's, a, that's what it is. Usually the island we start on, I can never find gold. Uh, we need some flowers for sure. That's alright. Yeah, no gold. That's okay. We'll probably spend one night on this island. Um, because we won't have enough time in the water to travel to a different one. I don't want to risk it. Uh, I'm not sure how long these videos are gonna be. I did just get new internet, so we'll see how long it takes to upload. But. I like to keep them a bit shorter so I don't have to wait, you know, eight hours of video. <laughs> it's just not fun. But I'll do what I can. My uh, son is also on my lap, falling asleep. Which is pretty cool actually that I can play games with him. Alright, almost dark. At night, for those who haven't played, make sure you're prepared with a torch or a fire. Or, yet again, instant death. That's when all the bad guys, ooh, bad guys come out. Those red snakes are actually alright to kill. You can get some good stuff from snakes and etc. But, uh, they don't poison you either. It's the yellow ones you gotta watch. Uh oh. Set up a camp right here, put some wood in it. Kind of just gather what we can around here and we'll take off in the morning. Uh oh. Uh, we don't. Yeah, we do. They're pretty easy to dodge. One dodge, you can kill them with an axe. Not the ideal weapon, by the way, either. Gotta use what you have, you know? Right. Sand pile. You know what? I've never built anything with sand yet, but we'll probably find out pretty quick that we need to uh, eventually use it. Anyway, put this, launch it. We'll head west in the morning. Oh, there we go. Alright, let's get out of here. I'm not sure, you see that? How he just shocked? I've never been shocked by one of those. Oh, we're not gonna ever for that. Seaweed's good for food and sails. Probably other stuff too. Armor, maybe. Can't remember. Uh, but if you're ever desperate for food, which. I mean, there's tons of food in this shipwrecked version of it. There really is. It doesn't seem like it at the start, but there is seriously so many food sources. Um, but if you ever do get into jam, Hop on your boat. Just go around your island. Get a ton of seaweed. It's it's easy and it'll fill you. Make sure to cook it though. Same with the limpets. Uh, I'm pretty sure you have to cook them, or you get a little bit sick. Gold, good sign. 
If there's a little bit more gold, this is an awesome biome for food right here, too. However, it's a tiny island. Huh. Uh, all these? The shoal? Hope I pronounced that right. Uh, it's all fish, right? You get a fishing rod, you're good to go. Finally, there we go, make a garland. Oh, I didn't want to, I'm just going to eat that because I don't have room right now. So this island's tiny, I'm not really going to live here. I'm going to grab the gold. Um, and then we're just going to take off again. Try and find something else. A little bit bigger, a little bit more diverse in bio. It's, I'm going to say it's probably a good thing though to uh, have bases set up on all these different islands. I just realized we could have built a hammer already. So yeah, we'll have to go back and get that boat repair kit. I mean. One gold. Um, you know what, we're going to get rid of these for now. I think those are good for uh, sales. I should have grabbed all the grass as well like I go through everything like nuts I'm sure everybody does I mean but we got a full stack so yeah we'll just head this way the waves I don't know if I covered them last time but try not to get hit by them but I'll show you if you uh, go the same direction they're going see I got a little bit wet there but yeah, you go the same direction they're going, it's pretty good, works out as the speed boost. So when you're traveling, obviously try to just go the way the, the waves are going, it makes life a lot easier. Um, you'll notice too, once the weather gets a little bit worse, the waves get worse. And I don't think you can follow them once they get bigger, but anyway. Uh, coral, don't really need right now, used for some building stuff. Okay, we really got to set up a camp so we can uh, use some of this stuff up and store it. Alright, sweet. Already looks like a nice island. We might just live right in the center here if we can find some gold. I really... Oh, you know what else is good? Ooh. It's good to pick all this up by the way like I know it kinda sucks that'll stay but there's wind in this game and when it gets windy that stuff actually blows away it'll just blow right into the water so why don't we plant that I actually that's palm tree I wonder if it'll grow in this biome or not okay good stuff got at least two biomes so far hopefully this there's gold that's a good sign Oops. just grab it right now yeah you are a pack animal jeez don't you love when characters that you play bitch at you jeez do it well so that would be like a swamp which in this is horrible it's just death. Spiders are great to see here. We're definitely going to set up a base here. So before we explore anymore, because uh, it's going to get dark again and I can't fit anything else in my inventory. We definitely need wood though. Chop some wood down. We're going to set up our, our camp up, maybe at the edge where the other biome is. Uh, the reason I like to build in bigger biomes and stuff is the shore actually, like the tide comes in and it'll wipe your whole camp out if you're too close to the edge of the shore, the shoreline. Plant these, got no room right now. Yeah, I know. Just eat it. Oh wow, actually it's a good thing I ate that because I didn't realize we were so low on food. 
Let's take a look at our map here. There's the shore there. So, you know what? I didn't even realize there's already, like, there's our camp. That's awesome. How didn't I even realize that before? We already got a drying rack. Awesome. All right, I'm going to end it here, and I'll see you guys in episode two. Thank you for watching. Have a good one, guys.